My name is Brendan Guest. I am the head of the senior school at St Philip's Christian College in Cessna. At St Philip's Christian College Cessna, our HSC program has a range of pathways that we offer. The first pathway that we offer is a pathway to an, with an ATAR directed at entering university. This is a very academic pathway. Uh, most students who take this pathway would look at doing a full range of academic subjects, possibly bringing in a, a VET subject if that's what they'd like to do. But this pathway leads students to a ATAR at the end of it, looking to go into a tertiary line of study beyond their HSC. Our second pathway that students take is a HSC pathway with a non-ATAR. This pathway is designed for students who are not necessarily looking to go to university, but are looking more at a trade or vocational pathway of study. This allows students to have a focus on a VET subject or a trade subject or maybe a traineeship, as well as completing their HSC without maybe the academic rigour that sometimes comes with an ATAR pathway. This pathway allows students to have a bit more flexibility in their day-to-day -day timetable. Some students doing this pathway will be off-site for traineeships. Some students will be doing a range of VET subjects, but this mostly leads students into a post-school pathway of, of traineeships or apprenticeships or even work placement once they finish their HSC. One of our most exciting pathways for our HSC program that we're bringing in in 2021 is our Diploma of Business Entrepreneurship. This pathway offers students the opportunity to not only complete a HSC, but also complete a Diploma in Business Entrepreneurship through Year 11 and Year 12. At the end of Year 11 and Year 12, these students would have both a ungraded HSC, an ungraded ATAR of possibly up to 75, um, as well as a Diploma of Business Entrepreneurship, a range of VET qualifications, and a huge amount of industry experience. This pathway would allow students to be at school for three, three and a half days a week, um, doing both a combination of online and face-to-face -face learning, while also spending a fair amount of time in a workplace, getting industry experience, getting on the job experience, and working towards a career um, of business ownership, of trade um, qualification, of running their own, uh, building business or, or electrical engineering business or one of the trade based type businesses that they may want to go into. Um, it's a really exciting opportunity that we have coming in 2021.